I, I noticed that none of you are on social media, are you? Mm -mm. Do you are you like staying mm -hmm. away? Do you do you not like that, or is it scary? It's just not, or just, you said it was not. It's not my generation. I yeah, just it's not, didn't. It's not my. It's just not my thing. It's yeah. not my thing. I, I, Maybe one day. I don't know, but I don't see it. Yeah, I don't know. I see how it's good for businesses. I I can see that. Well, yeah, it all yes. makes it makes sense. I get it as a mm -hmm. as an idea. But yeah, for me personally, it just I'm social with the people that I. I like to talk to with. people. People are way too, in, too into these phones. I'm worried about everybody's posture. But don't you feel sometimes it would be good to just say whatever you feel like and just put it out there? No. Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> No. I don't want to just say whatever I feel and just put it out there. That feels very irresponsible and yeah. reckless. That George Clooney has a funny joke where he's like, I don't tweet because I drink. Oh, that's true, actually. <laughs> <laughs> which, which, is a, which is a good, a good line. And, that's and, very funny. And he delivers it great. Yeah. <laughs> Do you feel that women, we have more pressure on us than, than guys have today? Because we have to be like perfect in so many senses, you know, in careers and always have to look good, especially in your profession, you know? Do you feel that we have more pressure than, than guys? I mean, I don't, I, you mean to have a, to be successful? Yeah, all, I all, think, everything, yeah. I don't feel that personally. I mean, I, I know that there, I, I think when, when we stop feeling the pressure, it will, the pressure will be gone. Like, I don't feel pressure to, to be, I work because I love to work. Um, I'm healthy because I love to be healthy. But I do feel that people sometimes focus too much on, trying to achieve unrealistic goals, you know? And I think you should just be sort of more happy with where you are and who you are. Are you happy with me right now? Mm-hmm. Let's put them, you're doing great. What time is it? Yeah, I'll make a note of it. You were, you were happy <laughs> at, at 3.45 PST. 3.45, yeah. I said it. Mark that down. Um, I, uh, I guess just the, the number. Yeah, nice meeting you. Uh -huh. Sandy with two sons. It was too, right? No, I mean, I think, yeah, we do get labeled. I mean, I, I mean, we get labeled as, as actors, I think. Mm -hmm. so, um, but I don't, I don't know if that's the case. And that <laughs> was, was that answer? That was you. That was you trying Genuinely. to bridge the gap. Trying to bridge the gap with the fellow, like, and sort of, you know, putting your foot in your mouth a little bit. Just now? No, no, no. The oh yeah, oh like yeah. Because I, I just felt like I put my foot. Because I say I have two daughters. You're yes, like, yes. Same I'm boat, getting nervous. I'm trying to slurp. Yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. I think she so, was just trying to be self-imposed. Yes. <laughs> nickname. So mm -hmm. how do you feel you get labeled as actors? Hmm? How do you feel you get labeled as actors? You were just saying that. Sort of uh, I don't know. I think sometimes you can get typecast. Sure. You know. That's an example of it. Yeah. And. um I mean, labeled in the media, you know, the even just the, the the job of, you know, actor or actress or anything comedian artist anything serious, in general dramatic actor yeah. comedy actor oh no he's not yeah yeah so that's all and then you gotta sort of you know make choices for yourself to figure out if you are more than that we all you take are. the chances to go expand there you go get spread out your of that wings. box take Bye. yourself out of the box. <laughs> I'm here for a job. Tell me more about this tween and your ex-husband. I'm sure I exaggerated. I'll have a better idea once all the acne clears up. <laughs>